The entire city of Portales has been without water for more than a day and a half now. Repair crews have worked through the night and today to return service. We've learned the line has been fixed, but full service will not be restored for a few hours more. As you can imagine, going without running water for this long has not been fun for the people there. Here's News 13 Cheyenne Cope. Portales residents were lined up with buckets this afternoon waiting for their turn to get some water. As far as uh, bathing, it's very difficult. Uh, luckily, I did right before they couldn't turn it off yesterday. Since about 5 p.m. yesterday, the entire city has been without water. While installing a reuse water line to irrigate city parks, a main water line was hit. Normally, it's not a big deal. We can isolate a leak. In this, in this instance, we were not able to isolate the leak. So we ultimately had to shut down the, the entire city in order to fix it. So for almost 24 hours, the city has been without running water. I live with my elderly mother, and it's been real difficult for her um, because of health reasons. Um, the bathroom situation has been very difficult. It's been tough to find a place to eat for the last 24 hours. All the restaurants and many other businesses in town have been closed. <laughs> Both city and county emergency services work to get water to high priority areas. A tanker truck was set up at a church for residents to fill up and another at Roosevelt General Hospital. Another example of getting water out to those who need it most is right here at Heartland Nursing Home where they drop this portable water tank to make sure they stay up and running. And on the campus of Eastern New Mexico University, students had to haul buckets of well water to their dormitories. Stand by. And Kim, we've learned that some areas are already beginning to see some water pressure, and hopefully it'll be restored fully within the next few hours. Back to you. Okay, thanks, Cheyenne. Now, Portales residents tell us that the city has been very good about keeping them updated on the situation through their emergency management telephone system.